I've had uh, volunteers that's put up my fence. I've had volunteers doing the roofing. And I have some wonderful young men out here that are helping me in my flower beds for the damage that was in my flower bed. We're just digging up the irises and then moving them over in some water, giving them a drink, and then planting them again. Something called me to come out here, the Lord told me to come out here and help, because I mean, helping the helpless, it really helps your Christian walk, in my opinion. It drove me out here because I hate seeing like people struggling, I hate seeing the devastation. And I've always wanted to like go help with, like when Katrina hit, I want to go help, and here I want to help. Well, I appreciate these young guys. They were eager to come, and I'm excited that they're here. That's, that's what we want to do is get all of our guys involved in uh, ministry and start them at a younger age. They're amazing. They're coming from so far, and you know, many of them spending their vacation time to come out here, and they just go nonstop. I think we forget the volunteers need to be served just like our citizens who've been affected. Our goal was for them, when they get out of the tornado, to really have a place where they could rest, where they could get refreshed. We brought them in, put them in our housing. They needed to eat. We opened up the cafeteria. I know the school took a step of faith to say, okay, you know, we're gonna go ahead and open up our campus to whatever it may be. And, um, and so I, I, I do wanna thank them for that. Our fabric, and our motto, you know, as a college is service to Christ. And so we consider if we serve the least, the last, the lost, that we've served, we've served our master. It makes me feel like I'm really doing something. It's, sad, it's satisfying to help these people because I know that they need it. I don't know how to thank somebody that's done so much. All I can say is I will play it forward. I will volunteer more than I have ever have. And I tell you, they're just my angels. I, I, I just love them to pieces.